I use one tool for 95% of everything I do in my business. Notion, from writing, scheduling, to selling digital products, you name it. And in this video, I'll explain how I run my entire business with Notion in three ways. So you can reduce all your SaaS subscriptions and simplify your life as a founder. Hey, I'm Chris, and I've been using Notion since their 2.0 days, about six years ago. I don't just use Notion for taking notes. I've built my entire business off Notion. Arguably, I wouldn't have a business without this tool. And at the end of this video, I'll show you how you can get six months Notion Plus for free, saving you up to $6,000, so stick around for that. I think it's crazy that many of us working in tech, we're obsessed with tools, but I get it. Anything to boost your productivity and be more effective. But I'm telling you, if you simplify your tools, simplify your workflow, you not only save your startup money, but as a founder, you'll probably sleep better too. If you haven't used Notion, where have you been? Notion is a productivity and workspace tool. Similar to Trello, Basecamp, Asana, or Confluence, anything that organizes work for individuals and teams. But I use Notion in three different ways. It's my source of truth. I use it to build systems and streamline my operations. And finally, I use it to sell digital products. The first thing, source of truth, where all the information lives about my business. What usually happens to founders is that as their business grows, you'll adopt more tools and information is siloed. Meetings on Google Docs, tasks in Trello, finance and sheets, customer feedback in SurveyMonkey, contacts in HubSpot, password in one password, and so on. Well, you just want one place, and I don't mean your emails. Notion is my one place. I can pretty much find everything. Everything is searchable thanks to Notion AI. My source of truth is where every single documentation lives. Weekly meetings, rough notes, action items, owners, account details, passwords, and emails to manage our accounts. Financials, I track expenses, income, all the boring number stuff. I track talent, like applications for roles, job description. It's my talent database. Sponsorship pipeline, I capture my new leads, track them through the pipeline, and remember to follow up. It's my CRM here. Research insights, search customer feedback, survey results, and finally, organize things into hubs. Here's my marketing strategy hub, where everything to do with marketing is at a glance. Guess what? It doesn't have to be pretty to look at. You can customize it however you want, and I won't judge you, just take a look at my homepage. It's a mess, and a great reminder for me to tidy up. But more than that, I like everything just one or two layers deep, so you don't have to overcomplicate it. All right, the second thing, systems and operations. How my business functions and what we do internally. Let's say your business is booming. You're hiring more people and you're becoming more methodical and structured with your approach. But that comes with its own challenges. Building processes, systems, writing how-tos, onboarding new colleagues and planning for more and more complex projects, just a lot of headaches. You need a platform that has flexibility to tie everything together and even go so far as linking objects. These are related items. Here's two use cases of how I do it with Notion. First is product launch, a calendar to view what's happening and when. A timeline to see how long the event might be. Different initiatives in order to make the event successful. And within that, tasks. The owners. That links directly to the calendar and timeline. I can't imagine a launch without this system. The second system I can't live without is scheduling. Running a content business means there's something to publish every single day. Not only do you get to see the calendar, you get to see the task incomplete by each member. Yeah, let's just forget about that. You didn't see anything. And inside each item, you can assign the correct owner based on how ready the content is. Associate that to a campaign, topic, and even tell your team about the format. And if you're a nerd, automate tracking of metrics like impressions and engagement. My favorite thing about this is being able to build a guide using templates. That means every time I write a piece of content, I have the best practices, examples, and a checklist of what I need to do. 
Setting up these systems to help our day-to-day -day operations has saved me so much time and effort, especially with onboarding or training. Pro tip, add a video to the guide to make it foolproof. You're only as good as the systems you put in place. And finally, the third thing I use Notion for in my business, in my business, is the product. This is what my customer sees, what they can interact with and buy. Imagine this, you're running a business and you're selling eBooks and PDFs or other downloadables. You already know this, but it's a nightmare to update. Even when it's updated, you have to send emails to your customers saying, please download the right file, right? And what about if you're selling an online course? You've probably chosen a platform like Kajabi or Teachable to deliver the videos. You have to go through the process of filling in all the information in their preferred format and flexibility is honestly limited. Not to mention those platforms are expensive as f What you really want is your product to be like software, updated in an instant and extremely easy to distribute. So here's what I sell using Notion. Playbooks. Imagine this as an ebook, like a cooking recipe for design. I give my customers easy step-by-step -step guides to execute any UX project. I update any content at any time, categorize them neatly, and simply send them a link. I also host a video course with 165 video lessons all within Notion. Each module is clearly separated. Each lesson has associated resources and they can easily be marked done. Both of these digital products require no login, nothing to download, and I never have to worry about the platform taking a fee for every sale I make. Now the question is, have I convinced you to ditch all the other tools, all your other tools, that does one specific thing, and switch to a platform that does them all elegantly? I mean, do you want to be more lean, more effective, more zen, like their design language? Do you, you, as a founder, want to simplify your business and life? And every startup is looking for a silver bullet solution here. And I believe this is pretty goddamn close to that one tool that rules them all. It's your choice. By now, you're probably convinced. Here's how you, as a founder, can get six months of Notion Plus for free. First, submit your application using my link. I've dropped that in the description. Fill in the details. Select my name on the partners list. Include my partner key. Startup 4110P53456. <gasps> anyway, I've left all the links and details below. Thanks again, Notion, for sponsoring this video. For more Life of a Founder content, hit the big red button. And until next time, bye.